I always feel like metadata user group meetings are a kind of self-selecting, a biased group for people who want to change the way the industry works. It's really exciting to be sitting here in front of this huge room, bigger than, than our rooms have been in the past, and knowing that we have that kind of momentum. How do we shift healthcare from being where it's been, sort of episodic and reactive? You wait for the chest pain, the lump, the, the stroke, and shift it to continuous and proactive, where these sensors disappear into our environments and we're much more on top of our own data and those of our patients and can be much more, again, proactive in our care. It's a discussion about innovation, transformation, disruption, change, and it's just nice to be a part of that discussion. And it's this idea of future-proofing our platform, making sure we can do new things that are beyond what's done today. These are the new branches of the tree, the new leaves. And as physicians and healthcare systems and pharma, we're going to get paid more in the future for outcomes, not just for prescribing the drug or the device. I think that if we had more technology, that we could offer solutions to patients, their engagement would go up. All right. Why do you keep coming back to all these symposiums? Oh, these things are great. I think it's a great information sharing. You can talk to your various peers to get information, exchange information, best practices. It's an opportunity to find out what's going on and uh, possibly even influence some of the trends. There's so many reasons to come. And so the question for you is how are you going to be the disruptor and not allow Farmageddon to hit your companies as we move forward?